Hey everyone, it's Christina Daves. Thanks so much for coming by to my PR and marketing tips for real estate agents. Uh, make sure you subscribe to the channel and ring the bell. Uh, that way you will get notified of all of these videos that I'm putting out for you. I've worked with so many real estate agents, uh, so many amazing success stories. So now I wanna share them with you because I know that Agents are really struggling to stand out. It's a noisy world. It's a noisy world online. There's so many agents. So one of my absolute favorite things is media, uh, landing in the media. And so many agents think, I can't do that. Um, I'm a new agent. Why would the media want to use me? Uh, I don't know how to give a good interview. I don't. So this is why on this channel, I give you all kinds of tips. But one of the easiest ways to land in the media is to pitch local. Be your local media expert. Uh, I'm gonna send you over through a link to my blog where I actually interviewed three people in my community in the Washington DC area, um, the Washington Post, the Washington Business Journal, and then Inside Nova, which is a local paper. And they gave us some great ideas of how to land in the media. And it was really interesting because the journalist from the Washington Post said, I wish I had more names in my Rolodex. And for you young agents out there, that used to be how we stored phone numbers on a little card in something that spun around. Uh, but she wants more resources. Another thing we learned from her is don't just pitch, oh, here's another million dollar kitchen. Give something good, do some research. What's the history of the property? Uh, she shared some great examples of, um, for example, there was a studio apartment in DC that was on the market and a cartographer had painted original Washington DC all throughout the studio. Very, very cool. There was an apartment, I'm sorry, a house renovation they were doing then the houses on the market. Well, when they broke through the drywall, they found Civil War maps. Like those are cool stories. Uh, I personally had a client who got on the front page of the Washington Post real estate section for a property uh, that she had listed that had what was called a pint sized bathroom in it. And back in the 1800s, all the bathrooms were in the upstairs in the um, bedroom areas. So if you were entertaining and somebody used the restroom, they had to go through your master bedroom to get there. So what they did is they started designing these little pint size, basically a powder room under the stairs in these homes. And they were very small and ceilings were low. But this one particular home had been the first hotel outside of Washington, D.C. ever. That's a little bit of history right there. And it still had one of these pint sized bathrooms. And I believe there's less than 100 left in the country. That's a cool story. Um, celebrity sells. I had another client who um, sold Linda Hamilton of Terminator fame's property. And that's how she got in the media. She used the celebrity. And you might think, oh, well, I don't want to do that to my client. Your client's trying to sell their property. So by using that to, to everyone's advantage, you're going to sell it so much faster. So really focus in on your local market. Do your homework on your properties, on the community, maybe the land that it sits on. Maybe somebody lived there. Somebody lived in the neighborhood. Maybe they filmed a movie there once upon a time. It doesn't have to be current. What's the wow factor that you can do? The other thing I want you to do uh, when you're pitching locally is look at what is happening nationally and how can you bring that home? How do you take a national study that was done by Trulia, Inman, Realtor.com, and take that and relate it to your local real estate market? Uh, be, be an expert, be a pro. Uh, I'll give you one last one. Just to, This is just to give you some ideas. But I have a client, uh, when HQ2 was announced in the Northern Virginia area, she was a realtor in that area. And instead of pitching like every other real estate agent did, oh, I can tell you what it's gonna mean when Amazon comes, she pitched, but then she said, hey, I'm heading out to Seattle on vacation. Let me take some B-roll, which is just basic footage off your phone. And let me find out what happened years ago when Amazon went to Seattle. And then we can talk about that here. And she ended up, I believe it was three segments for sure, two related to Amazon coming. And then she became, 
You know, once you're in once, the media loves you. If you make a great guest, again, it's that Rolodex, they're gonna put you in there. Uh, so think about how you can pitch great stories locally. That's where you wanna be. You wanna be the expert in your community and people love to work with the famous real estate agent. So pitch yourself, make yourself famous, learn more from all these videos, subscribe and ring the bell so you know when we put out new videos and I can't wait to see you in the media.